Santa Ana, Integrative Nutritionist for the Amen Clinics and your Wellness Wednesday host. Today we're going to complete our discussion with the hunger hormones. So last week we talked about ghrelin, the hunger hormone. So if you missed that video, hop back to last Wednesday and check it out. Today's topic is leptin. Leptin is a hormone responsible for signaling the brain to tell us to either burn or store fat. So after you eat, the body releases leptin, which tells the body to stop feeling hungry and to start burning those calories. Interestingly, the more fat your body carries, the more leptin you produce. But your body starts to become resistant, similar to insulin resistance. We want to optimize this, this hormone by eating foods that increase your body's sensitivity to leptin. So habits that decrease leptin, which is what we don't want, are eating the majority of your calories at dinner, having a large meal, that can delay leptin production for up to two hours after a meal. And alcohol. Alcohol doesn't allow the body to produce leptin when it's in the liver. Caffeine can also decrease leptin levels. High fructose corn syrup can cause leptin resistance. And simple heart carbohydrate consumption can slow leptin movement. So we want to decrease your foods like bread, cereal, pasta, cookies, crackers, bagels, muffin, croissants, and donuts from your diet. So none of those. Now, habits that increase leptin, which is what we do want, are to increase your omega-3 fatty acid consumption. So include those foods like fatty uh, fish, salmon, halibut, uh, wild planet sardines or anchovies are excellent options. Protein consumption can improve le leptin sensitivity. So uh, we want to have at least 30 grams of protein at breakfast and at least another 60 grams throughout the day of protein. EPA, which is one of the omega-3 fatty acids, can improve or increase leptin production by enhancing the metabolism of glucose. So again, those omega-3 fatty acids. Zinc can also increase leptin levels. So eat grass-fed beef, oysters, some nuts contain zinc. You can try supplementation as well. Okay, so I hope this helps you improve your leptin sensitivity. Take care. Mm -hmm.